You know what time it is. You know what time it is. You know what time it is. No more running away. It's time for me to fight this war. Stay the tall and knock on that wall. I have a dream. What's up, guys? We back with another Need for Speed Heat fastest drag cars. Did somebody say glitch start? That's right. We're here to talk about the three ways people consider, some people consider to be glitch starts. We're going to hop out to the road. We're going to show you how to do them so you know. And if you didn't know, you will now. So let's get started. All right. The first one I'm going to do is where you square your tires and you tap square. What you want to do is you want to put it in the second gear. Okay. And you're going to rev your engine. You're going to hold your e-brake. And then when you let go, you're going to tap square. We're going to do it the same way. We're going to put it in second gear. We're going to rev our engine. We're going to hold the brake. We're going to tap square. From my experience, this is the best one. It is supposed to give you the most acceleration off the line. And supposedly, I haven't really noticed or not, give you a boost at the end. The second one we're going to talk about is the way that you rev your engine a certain way. You're going to be starting off in the first. You're going to rev your engine a certain way. And then as soon as you let off the square, you're going to switch gears in the second. This is supposed to be able to give you a better boost off the line as well. So what you're trying to do is you're not, you're not revving it all the way up like that. The sound you're looking for is it going to be a crackle and it's almost going to be a cadence. When you hear people doing this right here, they're doing this start. You hear that slow cadence? And what you're going to do is you're going to let off square and change gears real quick. Right, we're going to do it one more time. Remember, you want to hold the cadence. And how you do that is by letting off the gas just a little bit so the needle bounces on the red line. And then you're going to let off square and shift in a second real quick. Let's do it. See, it's hard to hold. Okay, that method right there is not supposed to be as good as the spinning the tire method. But it still is faster than a normal start. All right, we're going to switch cars and I'm going to show you the third way. All right, guys, here we are with the Evo. Uh, this is the third method. Uh, it doesn't work with every car, um, but it's a little different than the others. What you're going to want to do is put it in the third gear. All right. Then you want to rev your engine and then press on your brake to cause this sensation right here. See, what it causes is, and this is why you can't do it with certain cars, there's a lot of cars out there that actually, whenever you put it into a third gear or a second gear or whatever, and you squeal your tires, it still goes all the way to the red line. You want cars, and you want the car to be set up in the way to whenever you squeal your tires, you're not going all the way to the red line. So what you're going to do is, is you're going to squeal your tires in third gear, and right when you let off, you're going to bump it back down in the second. Here's an example. All 
All right, we'll do it one more time. You're going to put your car into third gear. You're going to squeal your tires. When you let off the go, you're going to downshift into second quickly. One more. All right, guys, let's go back to the garage and talk a little bit about it. All right, guys, here we are back in the garage. Those are the three ways that some people consider to be glitch starts. I'm kind of up in the air about them. I haven't really decided if they're glitches or not. And the only reason why I haven't is because they are in the game. So I'm a little up in the air about it. I understand everybody's concerns. That's why I wanted to show you how to do them. Now that you know how to do them, you're aware when other people were trying to do them to you, so you can do them as well. That way there is no upper hand and we're on the same basis. I know me and Garrett have been talking about not, not allowing people to actually do these starts. So we'll, we'll see what happens in the future. Um, if you have any questions, go back in the video and watch them over again. If that doesn't explain it to you, I'm more than happy to answer questions in the comment section. Just drop it and I'll answer it. That's how we'll get it, baby. If you like this video, hit that like button. If you like the content, baby, hit the sub button. All right? All right, we do events every Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. If you want to be a part of it, hit that subby. Hit that noto and get involved. All right, that's it, guys. I'll see you in the next video. I'll see you in the lives. Have you ever felt? Are you listening? Damn.